I used to sort of do a little bit of wobbling around myself at times, like, you know. Yeah, no, I used to race 250s at British, European, and a little bit at Grand Prix, so yeah. I've had sort of quite a good time, really. 96, I don't know, I actually retired myself at the end of 95. And we had this idea between myself and Aprilia UK to run uh, super teams in the UK, which at the time seemed quite a good idea. I thought, yeah, I can do that, I'm quite enthusiastic. But to be honest, the first season and probably the second season was really, really difficult because being a motorbike race racer or a sports person, whatever, we're all very, very selfish in what we do. So I struggled to do all the hard work and put all the effort in, but not actually get the reward of being on track, which I'd done for like 14, maybe 15 years. So I did struggle with that and to the point I thought, you know, I need to walk away and do something totally different. But anyway. 20 years later, I didn't. I don't know what you do, Ray, because obviously you're involved in it and you sort of just, you get on and you do sort of season on season on sort of thing. But yeah, I'm sure at some time I'll sit back and think, wow, that was like sort of pretty good. Yeah, well, again, there's quite a big story. But yeah, they, they rocked up from Australia, mum and dad uh, and little Casey, uh, and they turned up with a caravan that I wouldn't have kept any dogs in, to be honest, to be honest like, you know. But anyway, so they end up living in our house for well, probably most of the season, to be honest. So, yeah, it was, yeah, it was good like uh, you know? Yeah, it did actually, because obviously what I've done for so long. But yeah, you've, you've got to try and move on. But yeah, no, if I think about it too much, yeah, there's, that is quite sad really. But, you know, it is what it is, isn't it? Well, what is the future, Ian? Well, that, that, that's the million dollar question, isn't it, sort of thing, really. But <laughs> the, the problem is, is, is getting more young people into the sport, isn't it? and that's, I, I, I've not got an answer for that at the moment, to be honest, like, you know. Well, hopefully, I I we'll run, all being well, a, a two man team on the V4. We've had a good, this has been our sort of learning year, really, with the team, and it's, it's obviously proved to be pretty good, so hopefully, we'll sort of step on and move up from there, hopefully. But again, I want to continue doing it with young, younger riders. I don't want, you know, your established guys who, you know, that they've had a good shot, and there's some sort of younger lads who've done four or five years in the sports deserve the opportunity, and hopefully we can do something there. Like that. You're bloody good looking, actually. What? Yeah. I can't believe it. Here you go, spec saver, Sid. Yeah. Should have got a spec saver, yeah. Well, see, I'm not going to be in shot. Why no. not? No. Come on, Sid. No, no. Hey, you made me look good. No, no, no. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is... <laughs> That's for the outtakes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.